Hi guys, it's Aaliyah. Welcome back to my channel. So today I am just um, jumping on real quick just to do a little show and tell for um, the like the tuck spots and pockets that I've been making for this journal here. And I know I'm all over the place because um, I recently finished the other journal that I was working on, the one with the babies on it, but I still need to do a kind of like a a final walkthrough on that so that is still you know pending <laughs> but this is a project I'm currently working on so I know I showed this in uh, the previous video but I wanted today to show the um, little tucks that I've uh, made for it and um, just kind of show you where I'm at so most of these tucks uh, well actually three of these tucks I usually do in every journal and there's two new ones that I just um I just not that I just started but I wanted to put in this jar I don't know I'll show you when I get there sorry I'm kind of confused <laughs> right now I have too many things in my head that I want to talk about so the first ones are the two little corner flip ups um these are the Rita Donnelly flips where you glue it down on two sides and then it flips up there and then just like all of these are really lightly decorated so there's that and then we have these and these are the Terry Woods pockets where each of these open up into a like a full sheet of paper so you can write on the full sheet and then fold the back up like let me just show you real quick so see it tucks into here and then you open this and then this opens and then you know all the sides open up too and then this one here tucks back into this here to make the tuck and the same thing with this one see how it's just tucked right down inside there and they're actually really easy to make I did do a video on how to make them oh a while back um, you know I might do a refresher one just to show you how I put the things together so especially these two are the ones I use all the time and I believe this is also Terry Woods I think actually I'm not 100% positive but I thought it was but I can do just kind of like a craft with me one day when I'm making uh, a new set of these and these just to show you how I fold the papers up and everything so that's actually an idea I might do um so okay so I have two of these and then I just want to keep these all together okay and then there's these ones and these are the ones that um, have the three tuck spots well it can have three tuck spots so when I put it on a page I glue this side and I glue this side and so then you can tuck something back here for one pocket here two pockets here three pockets oh and then this flips up so you can do some secret journaling underneath and then flip it back down so there's those and then so this is a new idea for me it's not a new idea because lots of people do it I've just never done it before so I was excited to try it so these are made from let me just grab the um, junk mail envelopes um, my mom started saving them for me <laughs> and um, so she basically just cut that part off because she knows that I'm only looking for the window so she saved up a bunch for me so I thought I would try it so as you can see here when you put something inside there's like a little pocket but it's like a little window pocket and then I just put some um, scrapbook paper in the back that way um, you know you're not looking at anything plain I think some had writing in the back so it basically covers all that up and then I just lined the outside with um, so the vintage music paper and um, decorated it just slightly and then the back is blank because it's going to be glued down onto a page and I'll probably um, glue this side and glue this side that way you have the pocket and then you can also um, tuck behind so that's what I'll probably do with that one and then here's this one so sorry about the glare there we go no glare okay so this one's also a thinner window but I still put the 
the paper, as you can see, it's the whole back is the paper. But you can see a little through the window, and then also whatever I tuck in there, you'll be able to see a little piece of that. And then it's, you know, decorated with a little bit of, uh, sorry, the glare again, a little bit of stuff. So that was a fun new thing that I did, and I really like it. And it wasn't very hard either, so that was good. And then I did these. Now, these are, um, like, let me show you. It will be on a page, so I'll put it on a page probably like this. And then what it is, there is a tuck here, so you can tuck behind here. You can also journal on here if you want to. Um, then there's a little, you know, you can tuck inside the pocket here, and then the whole page will open up. And then you have a little writing pad on this side with some different sized papers. There's a little lace I ran under there. Um, I made a little notepad with that on top. And then a pocket right here. I don't know if you can see, but a pocket right there. So there'll be ephemera in here, some writing space here, and then something tucked here, and then something tucked in there. So that was a new idea. I've never done that before either. This will sit on the whole page. Like this will be completely glued onto the page. I'm thinking, oh, I have glue all over my hands. Sorry. Um, hmm. Because I was thinking, hmm, I think I would rather have it completely glued down only because this snow pad gives it a little weight. Not, not a lot, but I don't want it to be kind of half down and then, you know, it like just is too much. So I'll probably glue the whole thing on to a page. Yeah, that's what I'll probably do. So yeah, so that was a neat idea. I thought that'd be kind of cool. And then there is, oops, this one. So just a little different decoration on the front. And then same, um, this part is the same on the inside. And then this, is just decorated a little different like that see but size wise and everything I believe um I mean they're pretty much the same see there's a little difference in in them but overall they're pretty much the same so I will have these and all of these in the new journal that I will be working on over the next couple of days. So that is what I am doing. I hope you enjoyed this little update and um, I want to get back to work and start placing these in the journal where I want them to go. So, and then make the ephemera and um, maybe I'll come back on when I'm making the ephemera. Hmm. Or I might just do a show and tell of the ephemera. Kind of depending. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Kind of depending on how I'm going to do it. I'm, I'm not sure. So I'm either the next video is either going to be just showing the ephemera that I made for the journal or possibly doing a craft along. Um, yeah, so I'm not really sure. Uh, plus I have a lot of the pre-made ephemera that I've done. So a lot of that also will go into here, but I also want to make this journal's own ephemera as well. So I'm going to use a mixture of both. Um, so yeah, so thanks so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.